holy. I'm not going to say that today because I'm pretending it's Christmas. I'm pretending it's Christmas down here at Scully's. I'm rusty, in case you don't forget me. Um, I'm pretending it's Christmas today because it's time to start watching the liquor stores for specialty things that come out for Christmas. Um, whether I want to make for you today a rum and eggnog. Hold on, forgot my ice. Hey, one sec, grab some ice. Need a couple cubes. Now, a rum and eggnog, which is where I want to go. By the way, you can make your own rum, uh, you can make your own eggnog. You don't need to buy it. Go look it up online. Uh, there's many recipes. Um, when you make a rum and eggnog, I'm going to skip right to the end. It was garnishing with a sprinkle of nutmeg. A sprinkle of nutmeg that goes great with eggnog and when you're using it. Now a rum and eggnog is not rum and eggnog anymore. It changed to spiced rum and eggnog. Now with a sprinkle of nutmeg. Now, if you're watching the liquor store this time of year for your Christmas and for your rum and eggnog, there is some stuff that comes out and it's limited edition stuff. This one that I got last year, I think, or the year before, is gingerbread. Gingerbread goes right along. It's all Christmas, eggnog, nutmeg. It's going to go perfect. The best rum and eggnog that I can make and I can only get the, and I, and I was lucky to get this because I was at the liquor store at the right time. You can probably tell what the flavor is um, to make a pumpkin pie. Oh yeah, it usually nutmeg. So it's kind of the perfect mix. And I, I, I had my better half make me some eggnog. Okay, so I'm gonna, as a rum and eggnog, only with this it's got it, it's actually jackal blast i'm sure that there's uh there are other companies that come out with stuff okay um all the time and especially stuff but as christmas comes watch the liquor store now to get stuff like this so that your rum and eggnog can be as great as mine peace out